Hello there everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Animal Boxing. So, after a bit of a break from uh, from this for Mortal Kombat Week, I am back and uh, we are starting off with a new opponent. So you guys don't hear him in commentary mode yet, so that's good. Anyways, here we got Bruce the Wolf. Kind of reminds you of Gray, doesn't he? Anyways, here's his profile that I made for him. Bruce is an eco-warrior at its finest. He dedicates most of his time to picking up trash and spreading awareness. A good point, he's tidy. A bad point, he's aggressive. He likes fellow eco warriors, and he dislikes polluters. So he's basically kind of like Daniel Bryan back when he was a heel a few years ago. Though maybe maybe not as aggressive. I'm sure he wouldn't grab someone's hot dog and throw it at their head, would he? Right, spill soda all over them. Maybe maybe he would. I don't know. But, uh, good news is we're almost done with the, uh, dog circuit, so that's, that's good, because after this we got something else. Yeah, we got, we got something really, really unique and different, I must say. I, I'm quite amazed they, they thought of this amazing idea. You're not going to believe it when you see it. Oh, and there goes my keyboard. Yeah, well, whatever, I'll pick it up later. I don't need it right now. I just need to watch the footage and commentate. That's what I'm here to do. After all, I'm not here to pick up freaking keyboards. Oh crap! I'm down. Yeah, Bruce is quite the hard hitter, I must say. Quite the hard hitter. I think that's the same pose that Bruce has. So I was one of those guys are supposed to be brothers or cousins or something. Because it does seem like uh, they reuse a lot of the character models. I just color in a bit differently, kind of like what uh, Mortal Kombat used to do with the ninjas and whatnot. I mean, there is a lot of characters in this game, don't get me wrong, but uh, that is one problem. They do kind of blend together after a while because, again, they the models are kind of the same sometimes and whatnot. There aren't too many unique models that I've seen personally, like... Uh, I think Cammy might be one of the only unique models, now I really think about it. Oh gosh darn it. Freaking Bruce. Is this because I drank a soda earlier? I'm sorry, dude. I will recycle the plastic cup, alright? I'm not going to throw in the garbage, I promise. But I, I was thirsty, okay? I need a drink. Oh boy, I, I think we're going to go to round two, oh boy. Darn, that sucks. Usually I can be everybody in round one, but not this time. Yeah, well, he's almost down, so... No big deal, just... Getting a few more hits, and it will be over, and it'll all be good. And then there will be cake. Hopefully. I could go for some chocolate cake, personally. Or just some chocolate, that works too. That works too, thank you, game. I appreciate that. Alright, can I finish him now? Please, thank you. That went a little longer than I would have liked. But whatever. It's all good. It's all done. He's down. He's out. Moving on to the next circuit. I think he has a different lose animation than uh, Gray, at least. So there is that. But then again, maybe I'm remembering wrong. I don't know. And that's got to be a pretty generic play. It's just a paw print. It's like every high school and college team's logo, you know? It's like, let's call ourselves the Wildcats, let's call ourselves the, speaking of cats, that's the next circuit, let's call ourselves the freaking Cougars wear, and we'll just use a paw print, it's like, so lazy! And why, why does Tormi already have an angry mark on her head, is that a glitch? Seriously, is this because I had to take a break? Sorry, but I was tired that day, but, uh, anyways folks, here we go with a rematch between Nayoshi and Tormi, and, oh, what a, what a hook right away from Nayoshi. But Tormi's not just gonna sit there and take it, I imagine, yep, she's coming back with a few more punches of her own, but, oh, Nayoshi's got her, got her in a combo now, oh, but she's out already. Usually we're used to those combos lasting longer, but not this time, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. This is uh, quite the matchup, isn't it? It's so exciting. So slow-paced right now, unfortunately. But that's the way it goes sometimes. Sometimes it goes slow-paced at first. 
but don't worry. Don't worry, I'll pick up later. I'll pick up later when Nayushi gets angry. And here it is. It's in. The anger's in. And now here we go. Now the speed's going to pick back up. Fantastic. And she's down. She's down. She won't stay down for the count because there's nobody there to count. So who really freaking cares? Who really freaking cares? Nobody. That's who. All right, here we go again. Here we go. Let's go. Take that. Yeah, take all those punches. Look at that amazing combo. Such amazing combo. And she's down again just like that. Holy smokes, Nayoshi. You just slaughtered her right there. That was impressive. That was quite the impressive move. My goodness. Can Tormi come back? Spoiler alert. No, she cannot. She will not be coming back because I'm going to win once again. And uh Oh, she's angry. She's angry. That's not good. That's not good. I'm going to have to go on the defensive again. That's not good. But oh, well, that's the way the game goes, unfortunately. That's just the way it goes. That's the way boxing goes in real life, too, don't you? You know, you can't just go swinging all around. No, you gotta be defensive as well. Otherwise, you get your butt kicked, and that would be no good. Nobody wants to get their butt kicked. Who seriously wants to get their butt kicked? Certainly not me. Certainly not anybody I know. Come on, Tori. You're almost down. Just go down. Go down, all right, please. Let's just save some time here. Go down, please. Oh, crap, she's angry again. Oh, that's not going to help. We'll have to go back on the defensive. Oh, great. Can I get her here? Can I get her here? No, she's still standing. Crap. Okay, how about, uh, give me this pepper. Oh, darn it, I missed the pepper. Oh, well. Oh, but now I'm angry now, too. I'm angry now, too. So, let's finish her. There we go. It's over. Ring the bell. She's out. She's down. She's out. It's over. Night Yoshi is victorious once again. fan freaking -tastic. Woohoo! On to the next opponent, who I don't remember who it is. I don't think it's the new one yet. I do remember there being one new character here, and I believe this guy has a hard to pronounce name. I can't remember. Oh boy, this is going to be fun. What's your name again? Uh, Bianca or something like that? I can't remember. I just can't remember for the life of me. How you doing, pal? How you doing? How you been since the last time I beat you? Yeah, Bianco or. However that's pronounced, I, I don't know how it's pronounced, and what a roar from Biako! what a taunt to start the match, I gotta give him credit, that actually is quite intimidating, but uh, does not matter because I'm gonna take him down anyways, yes I'm gonna take him down, take him downtown to Cripple Town, although I'm sure his injuries won't be that bad, I mean it is just face punches and whatnot after all, and maybe a few to the gut and whatnot, but uh, not too many. Yeah, I've got nothing to say right now. He's he's angry, but he's not doing much. He's getting his uh, getting himself into combos easy, and his punches can be a bit slow. I find so it's pretty easy counter. I personally find, but now I'm angry too. So now it's time to take it to him. Time to give him a good beating. Take that. Yeah, bam. He's down. He is down. He won't stay down for the count, though, unfortunately. I wish he would, because then maybe then this game go, could go a little bit faster. But no, unfortunately not. For whatever reason, they have to make it TKOs only, which really sucks. Really freaking sucks, if you ask me. But whatever. It is what it is. But now he's angry now, too, so that's not good. That means I gotta go back on the defensive. But uh, my anger just ended, so I guess it doesn't matter too much. Guess it doesn't matter too much. I could counter and whatnot, but I'm not going to take the risk. I don't want to take too much damage and go to round two like uh, like with Bruce early. That was no good. That was no good. If I rematch with him, I'm going to have to make sure I get, get him in round one that time. But, uh... Anyways, he's down again. He's down again. Stay down this time. But, of course, he won't. That, that, that just would make too much sense. It wouldn't a game. Yeah, it just... Just never happens, unfortunately. I wish it did, but it doesn't. Oh, well, whatever. And he roars again. Like, oh, I'm so angry. Well, too bad, pal. Don't matter. Your anger level isn't out yet. Isn't up yet, so it doesn't matter. Oh, now it is. Now it is. Oh, boy. It's like I called it by accident. Oops, my bad. My bad. All right, then. Hit him a few punch. Him with a few punches while he's, uh... Distracted or whatever, and there's the roar again. Seriously, why you, why you keep roaring at me, broski? You should be focused on punching me, and yet you're not. You're bit. You're pulling off a big mistake here, especially because I'm angry now, and I'm gonna kick your butt. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna get you without getting knocked down once. Heck yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Thirty seconds remaining too, so not bad, not bad for a heavyweight, if I say so myself. Since I usually struggle against them. And next up, we got a new character, I believe. So let me get her profile ready. At least I hope it's next. I think the new character. So you're third or fourth, if I recall correctly, in the circuit. Yep, here we go. So next up, we got Chun, and not Chun Li, despite the fact that I give her a little reference to Chun Li in her profile here. But, anyways, Chun is nicknamed the strongest woman in the village by many. Yeah, I, I think y'all know what that's a reference to. Her kicks can break a boulder in two. Oh boy, does she does she kick then? A good point. She's focused. A bad point, impulsiveness. She likes high kicks, and she dislikes using her fist. 
Well, you're in the wrong sport then, Chun, let me tell you. This is this is boxing, not kickboxing. You cannot kick me. So, yeah. Sucks for you, don't it? Sucks for you, don't it, toots? Okay, note, note to self, never fight Chun in a fighting game or in kickboxing, because she might actually beat me in that. But, uh... Yeah... I definitely feel like Chun was highly chun -Li inspired, not just by the name, but also by her look, like the... I don't know what those things are called in her hair, the buns or whatever. I feel like that's supposed to be a reference to chun Li. Maybe I'm wrong, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know, I've never... I've only ever played Street Fighter, like, twice in my life. I, I didn't really like it that much, if I'm honest, so... Yeah. I do, li I do like your outfit, though. I think that's a cute look for her. Cute little... Uh... Japanese or Chinese inspired dress or whatever that's supposed to be. I like it. Looks cute on you, Chun. Looks cute on you, but no, I don't want fan or mean Chun. No, thank you. I'm I'm good. And she's out. I do have to admit though, her knockdown animation is a little suggestive. Is is it just me? Like I don't even have to point it out, do I? But uh, yep, that's Chun for you, which means it's back to commentary mode. All right, so. Next up, who do we got? What chump is next? It's this guy again, whose name I can't remember. I think it's Apollo or something like that. Is your name Apollo? I can't remember. I hope I'm right. I might be thinking of the chicken, but I'm pretty sure that was Apollo, not Apollo. Come to think, are you related to Apollo Creed from the movie, from the Rocky movies? I don't know. So yeah, it's Apollo. Okay. And as you saw with his taunt there, it looked like he was going to rub his hand through his uh, hair there. That's why I always called him, or always thought that he was quite the narcissist, personally. That's why I gave him that profile I did earlier when we fought him before. But anyways, here we go with uh, Apollo. And holy crap, he's actually kicking my butt right now. This is not going to end like Rocky 1, though. This is going to end like Rocky 2, where I beat you. Yeah, I, I hope I didn't spoil the movies for anybody. Hope, hopefully I didn't spoil that. Sorry if I did. But seriously, those movies have been out for years now. You should have seen them by now, I'd, I'd hope. But uh, anyways, here we go. Well, I'm angry now. We're both angry, so we're about to see some hard hits. Yeah, get, getting some hard hits. Oh, he's down. He's down. He won't stay down for long, but uh, hey, it's it's still something. It's still something. Can I say, it's, it's actually kind of surprising. This guy is uh, not the champion instead of uh, Lee. Lee's the champion, which I always find kind of interesting. But uh, whatever, I do like Lee. Lee's a cool character, so I like them both. What can I say? That So there is that, but... Pardon me, I had to cough, but, uh, anyways, back to commentary, and he's down again, he's down again already, what a chump, what a chump, you think you can take anybody? No, I can take you down, easy punk, you suck, yeah, I'm better than you, I'm like MJF, I'm better than you, and you know it, although my health is a bit low, so I gotta watch out for that, because I really don't want to get knocked down, that would, that would suck, that would waste time, that's no good, I don't want to waste time, I just want to get, oh, crap, I said I don't want to waste time, yeah, I'm wasting time here by getting knocked down, crap, uh, whatever, whatever, I just, just realized there's a stool in the background, too, I wonder if that's the stool they use for when they sit in the corners and whatnot, I don't know, I don't know, I just thought I'd point that out, because that's interesting to me, but, uh, anyways, let's get back to kicking his butt, let's get, let's get this done, let's get the circuit done, this part, so that, that next part, we can start, uh, I believe, the gold circuits, which will be awesome, because, yeah, spoiler, after the silver circuits, it's gold circuits, who saw that coming, show of hands, who saw that coming, I know I did, because I played and beaten this game a few times before, and he's out, he's out, ring the bell, it's over, Nayoshi is victorious once again, Despite the fact that he's not a cat, he's going to be the cat champion eventually. But he's also the dog champion and a few other champions that he probably shouldn't be because he's not that specific animal. But whatever, it is what it is. And here we go with the champion, Lee. Last time we fought, I kicked your butt. Is it going to happen again? Spoiler alert. Yes, it is. I'm going to beat Lee once again. I can promise you that much. I can certainly promise you that much. Let's go, pal. Let's -a go. Here we go. Hit with a punch right away. Yeah. And I don't I don't know why he bent downwards there. It looks like it punched his face, not his chest, but whatever. Whatever. It don't matter. Can I just say his, his eyes look kind of weird after he gets punched, too? They get all glassy looking and whatnot. I always found that kind of weird. Very strange. I wonder why that is. I don't know. 
I just don't know, and his voice is kind of strange, Must I must say. I never thought, I always thought his voice didn't match his character, personally. Too bad they don't have a unique voices in this game, but obviously that would take quite a few, because we're already at, like, 43 characters so far. So, yeah, I guess, I guess it makes sense why they didn't get unique voices for each character, but still, it would have been cool. And he's down, he's down, he won't stay down, but uh, he's back up, doing the Shawn Michaels get-up animation. I like that, I like that, it's pretty cool. All right, then. Hit him with some, some more punches. Oh, what an uppercut. Oh, what a hook. My goodness, he is fighting back hard. I got him credit for that. Lee's not going to just sit down and take it. That, that's a... Oh, he actually knocked me down before I knocked him down a second time. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. You know what? I take back what I said before. He should be champion, not Apollo. Man, he's improved quite a bit since the last time we fought, hasn't he? Oh, my goodness. Oh my goodness, I might be in trouble, right? No, of course not, because he's down again. Stay down, but you're not going to stay down. So why am I saying that? I don't know. I just don't know. He's back up, though. Here we go again. Here we go. Oh, he's taunting me, but I didn't get full charge on my fist. Darn it. Oh, well. Oh, but he's angry. That's not good. That is not good at all. Uh-oh. I'm going to be in trouble if I get hit by MA's punches now. Ooh, boy. Got to avoid them all. Gotta avoid them all. It's like Pokemon only in reverse. Instead of gotta catch them all, you gotta avoid them all. Alright, come on. Go down. Go down. He's only got a little bit of health left. Come on, Lee. Work with me here. Work with me. Go down. You know, I, you know I'm the rightful champion, despite the fact that I'm not a cat. I should not be competing for the cat championship, but I am anyways. There we go. He's out. He's out. Ring the bell. It's over. Nayoshi is the new cat champion, despite not being a cat. Seriously, this makes no sense, but whatever. Whatever. Anyways, folks, that's going to do it for me. So thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next part when we start the gold circus. I'll see you all then.